Greetings, YouTube. Mysterio has been out for almost a week, and to be honest, I still don't really know what to think of him. I mean, he's not a terrible champion, but if you expected him to be a game-changing champion similar to other champions in his class like Stark Spidey or Ghost, then that expectation was met with literal smoke and mirrors. But uh, we have somebody who just decided, what the heck, I'm going to take this guy up to 565. And uh, look at that prestige. I mean, look at that PI, even with boosts, like 20,000. Are you kidding me? And so he uh, wanted to send on this video to kind of give the community some idea of Mysterio's potential. So first and foremost, huge shout out to the user, Yas. I don't know if that's like, Yas, queen. And there are multiple people who are listening to this that just like convulsed in horror when I said that. So that'll be the only time I say this in this video, I promise. But uh, I'm going to hit the play button against everyone's favorite man in need of a much better healthcare plan, Winter Soldier from Realm of Legends. And then while I play this video, I'm going to talk to you about what he said his strategy was in the fight and just in general when fighting with Mysterio. Okay. Generally, he tries to do a double medium to fill his three charges. And then he'll do a heavy attack for a weak poison. Now against a regen, if he ends his combo with the light, he'll get a 7 second heal block. Then basically, he just builds to a special 3, and then drops the special 2 with the fury from the special 3 and a poison. Does that sound confusing? Probably, but let's see it in action. Notice, he's got some decent crits going on, and I will say that Mysterio has, like so many champions in 2019, very beautiful animations. Regardless of what you think of Kabam, I think pretty much uniformly, we can agree. They produce champions that look great, that uh, are fun to fight with, and even somebody that's as trash as Diablo, I'd still say, is like a cool champion to watch fight. May not be the best, all right, check out that poison damage, 3,422 per tick. That's very significant. And there are not too many champions out there that are poison immune, unless you've got somebody great like, I guess, Medusa or Hyperion. And so I can also see this Mysterio potentially doing some work in attack mode of many quests. It's just... The poison to me is the major takeaway from this video. It's somebody that uh, kind of does a Dragon Ball Z like Kamehameha and then inflicts that poison. If you don't know what Dragon Ball Z is, that reference meant absolutely nothing to you. But can you see the energy ball that then you explode through your hands, people who understand what I'm talking about? Maybe? I don't know. But again, really cool special three. Just the animation is, uh, is gorgeous. I mean, think about back in the day, especially you old enough like me, around 30, to remember console fighting games. If that had been like a finishing move in Mortal Kombat, that would have been a game changer. Now it's on your phone, and we don't even think of it. I also want to take the time to say I've never made this comment in the video, but the other day, I was kind of watching, like, you know, the backgrounds of MCOC look really cool. And I don't even notice the background most of the time, because I'm so concentrated on, like, dexterity or parry. But, uh, yeah, they do a really good job with the backgrounds of the fights, too. It's worth stating that. So, Mysterio does a surprising amount of poison damage. And yes, this is a awakened 565. So this is kind of where the peak of the potential is. And I don't remember exactly what he said in terms of boost, but I'm pretty sure he's using a couple. Uh, but looks like a fun champion to fight. Maybe similar to how some people feel about Human Torch. I love Human Torch. I think he's super fun to fight with. Mine's not even awakened, and I don't care. Still is a champion I love to use in the arena, among other things. Mysterio might be in that class. Maybe as the game evolves, he'll get even better. But I'm very thankful to Yas for the video and for having the uh, courage to use his rank-up materials to take Mysterio up to max rank. So huge shout-out again to that summoner. And if you're uh, considering Mysterio and the uh, potential of this champion, now you hopefully have a little bit of data in the form of this video, as well as information to make your 
uh, purchase decisions and maybe even your rank up decisions if you were lucky enough to get Mysterio in the uh, featured calves or for that matter in the arena. Have a great day, YouTube. Thanks for watching.